salutations welcome welcome and welcome back to my channel it's melissa here back with another video uh i just filmed the haul don't know which one is going up first but this is you seeing my face you seeing my face in a very long time just letting you know yes i have my pet septum pierce yes i actually have any earrings in all my piercings right now well, except like one of my piercings i don't have earrings in but i have earrings in i have my hair down and braids <gasps> What? I have a full beat on. What? So, yeah. Um, if your energy matches my weird energy, you are so welcome here. This is a non-judgment free, this is a judgment free zone. We don't judge here. I'm going to talk about my favorite, absolute favorite, nude lipsticks. Now, nude for me is different from everybody else. So, um, if you didn't know, I have this thing called melanin. <laughs> I'm bleak. I'm a, a I am, well, multi, I'm half Nigerian and then my mom's side is a bit mixed up with everything. So I have this thing called melanin. I am not the deepest of the dark, but I have a good hue and I'm proud of it. And if I was browner, I, I'd be even popping. Like I had a best friend from Sierra Leone whose skin was so stunning and I was so jealous. I like to think of myself as like a patchwork quilt or a calico cat, like literally. I am different colors on multiple areas of my body. Like here, pale, <laughs> pale for me, pale for melanin. <laughs> like my arms, pale, even part of my arms, pale. My upper arms with my, like my flat, pale. My tummy, pale. My legs, because they don't see the sun, pale. My face and my neck and probably the, my forearm are probably the darkest parts of my body because that sees the most sun, especially in the summer. Short sleeves, um, even though I have been slathering myself in sun and like sunblock and uh, sunscreen. But anywho, it's, let's get into, I'm going to lip swatch. Oh, I'm going to regret this. I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna swat, okay. I'm gonna, I have my Kleenex in my hand and sitting somewhere on the side. I'm going to swatch on my hand. So I'm gonna have swatches probably all down my arm and then I'm going to lip swatch. I didn't think this out. It's okay. So I'm gonna wipe this off and then we're gonna get into it. Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna regret this later. I, I can feel it. I feel it, I feel it. Back with one of my favorites. This is Black Moon Cosmetics and with their Sinister Satin. I kept the box for this one. I bought for my birthday early this year in January. I bought the entire bundle. They had these on sale and I bought the entire bundle of these. No freaking shame. These are phenomenal. I gave uh, one to my sister. She freaking loves it because it's so pretty um, and it's really comfortable. So this is in the shade. Is this Wolf? Werewolf. So we're going to... There's that. And your girl loves a deep chocolate nude. I will say, these are the most flattering for my skin tone. So, this is Werewolf by Black Moon Cosmetics. I'm not sponsored by any of these brands. This is just me like knowing what I love and uh, going for it. For me, being a woman of color, I uh, I meant to, I was going to buy the Prop of Beauty ones. I was at work, I was getting ready to buy them. And something happened, there was a trauma. I work in the main OR and a trauma came in and I was like, yeah, I forgot. And then by the end of the day, I was drained, so I didn't, so. This is Werewolf Black Moon Cosmetics. I'm gonna regret this because I have like thick, I think I got like 16. Woosa Fraba. Okay, I am back. I realized I didn't turn my camera on while I put on the lipstick, but whatever. So here's a swatch, and this is actually L'Oreal and Color Riche in 860, yeah, 860 Spice. So right there, this was my everyday shade from 2010 to about 
2014, 2015. I've probably gone through at least 16 of these tubes. I kid you not. I had a backup. This is my last tube of this. It still, still has the same L'Oreal, like really nice lipstick smell and still really creamy. Now this does transfer and this did used to get on my teeth a lot, but I had a job at a call center and this was just really flattering because I had to talk all day. So, so this is L'Oreal Color Leash in the shade 860 Spice. On to the next one. Ugh. I tried to zoom in a little bit Whoop. extra. This is... I had a phone call and in between wiping off I was playing a Nyala Kamiqua's video. Oh, don't, don't come for me, baby. Don't come for me. Your girl's a nursing student and I already have student loan debt for my original English degree you're on broke. So... <laughs> I have the Sephora Lip Stories. Here's the component. Uh, this is hashtag Lip Stories and Molt Shake. It's the shade right here. Sephora Lip Stories. Molt Shake. Can you tell there's a theme with the shade of browns or neutrals I like? Especially for nudes, for me. Um, they say trick is your perfect nude is the color of your areola <laughs> dark browns just look good on my on my skin tone on my melanin so that's just weird can't whip out your t can't whip it ta ta at Ulta or Sephora and be like give me this nude <laughs> I want this shade for my lips that doesn't work so again Sephora lip stories molt shake third lip Okay, next up, I know they're on a timeout, but this was in my pile. I already own it, so we're just gonna go with it. The Juvia's Place, the Nude Chocolates. This is in Coco. This is a Velvety Matte Lipstick. This is the shade Coco right here. This is shade Coco on. I really like it. It's really good. Bought this on an Ulta sale. Or... <sighs> I do not need this much lipstick. But here's a kicker. I just panned four lipsticks in the last three weeks. Okay. Your girl goes through these things. It's, if that is, the, if I'm going to wear makeup, lipstick. My mouth is going to be decorated with a beautiful lip color. So again, Juvia's Place. Coco. And this is Ruby Kisses Color Design Custom Lip Styling. This is lipstick I be find in the beauty supply store. Okay, beauty supply store. This is it used to cost ninety nine cents. Then it went up to a dollar. Then a dollar oh five. Then a dollar ten. Now it's a buck ninety nine. I found a wholesaler and I bought like twenty of these. I've gone through nearly all of them. That and my signature like dark purple color. They have my favorite dark purple. This, I still have like five or six of these left, so I'm good. Here's the swatch of bronze. And this is me on. It's, as you can see, I've used up most of the tube. I, I go through this really quickly. It's super easy to like slap on, so. Here it is, bronze from Ruby Kisses. Okay, I'm back. This is ColourPop Lippy Stick. This is from the Make It Black collection. This is the shade Pitch. I'll show you in the tube. And this is a swatch right here. That's Pitch. And this is it on. I love this. I bought like two. When color plop gets it right, they get it right. I will say that. There's, you know, they have that going for them at least. Ah, shoot. It's okay. I can get it later. <laughs> okay. This is also color plop in the shade Oh Behave from the, I think, the Wild Thing 
collection. It was basically like going coconuts, but for, you know, people that have melanin, you know, people that are not the color of paste. So here's a swatch of Obehave right here, right next to Pitch. Oop, that one's running in the crease, <laughs> but yep. Here's Obehave and here's it on. So there's that. On, on to the next, on, on to the next one. My lips hurt. <laughs> All right, here I have, this is PMS from Fenty Beauty. This is the Matte Moiselle. I, don't, I think these are on like deep clearance discount on Sephora. Um, if you can get your hand on one of these, this is beautiful. I have Griselda and PMS. PMS, this is the sh uh, shade Swatch right here. That's PMS. Here's it on. away from the light I will say phenomenal I was really skeptical about Fenty Beauty and whatnot but uh that beautiful okay my lips hurt I'm only what seven in ugh eight eight in Lord have mercy. Okay, we can do this. Okay, this is Maybelline's Superstay Ink Crayon. This is Drive the Future. Now on the website, it's a, I bought this off Ulta. It's also has a deep cherry wine, but that's the swatch. Can't tell me that is not brown. Look, look at this, that's brown. Deep cherry wine, my foot. Not brown. That is brown. Oh, chocolate. Brown. That's brown. But yeah. Here's it on. And again, here's the swatch right there. Okay. My lips are burning. I'm burning, I'm burning, I'm burning for you. Okay. If you're matching my energy. All right. Okay, this is Ejin from Dose of Colors and Nima Tang. Stay glossy. This is it on. It's a beautiful nude gloss. It oh, it feels like heaven on my lips after just literally having satins and matte lipsticks <sighs> wiped off my lips. Mm. I don't look forward to taking this off, but luckily I have a nice array of colors that I'm good, or colors, but formulas I'm going to put on. So here you go, here's 10 swatches. We're 10 deep. Look at that, oh yeah. All right. Let's get to it. All right, and we're back with another dose of colors. This one is in Hot Cocoa, and I'm gonna swatch on my other hand. Don't mind, I actually have a ganglion. Ugh. It disappears. <laughs> um, but yeah. And this is it on. Okay. Here's the first 10, and here's Hot Cocoa from Dose of Colors. Just, I think, 17 more to go. All right, I'm back. Here's the swatch. This is of Fenty Beauty Heat. This is in Hot Chocolate, Hot Chocolate Heat. Um, I guess that one right there. This is it on. Oh, it's tingly. It's a plumping gloss. It's not a bad one. I actually really like it though. I'll be honest with you, the, I think the heat glosses are my favorite gloss bomb formula from Fenty Beauty. It's really nice. All right, let's do it. We still have like so many more 
more to go. <sighs> Let go. Alrighty, so we are back. This is the Kaleidos Lip Clay in the shade Mahogany. That is the swatch right there. And I will say the lip clay formula is phenomenal. I ordered another one of these because I'm almost to the tube. It's really good. And I ordered obviously a purpley pink one. And this is what's on. <laughs> so. We're almost there. We are almost there. And I'm almost there. Almost there. Woo! Okay. This is, I know, don't drink the Kool-Aid, girl. Um, but this is Melts. Liquid lipstick in Ebony. That's the shade right there. This, I will say, is an extremely watery formula. And you literally do have to shake it. And I will show you if you are interested. This is still available. As you can see, the component, it's literally very watery. But I will say, as you can see, it's all over the... It's not like it's old or bad. It's, it's fairly new. Literally, just wiping it off. Putting it back into the component. But it is very watery. But it's a really good product. Oh, it's starting to dry down. But here you go. Ebony. Melt Cosmetics. Here's it on. And I totally messed up my uh, Cupid's bow, so I had to do an exaggerated one. Good times. So, yeah. On to the next. I think I still have, like, three left. Two or three left. So, we're almost there. Okay. And this one is another uh, dose of colors. Liquid lip. I know. Who am I? Mel, who are you? I'm like, <laughs> somebody who's just been literally three years into a pandemic working nonstop, a deemed essential personnel, and I just had to find out stuff that had to stay on my face. This is in the shade like to see it uh, I don't know if this is available it was I bought it off their website they had, I think they had a restock so if you like this here's the shade like to see it liquid lip this is it on still a little tacky but really in a few minutes it will dry down and this is it on it's not perfect so please don't judge me on this because my lips are literally burning all right Almost there. Almost there. Last but not least, another dose of colors, liquid lip matte in chocolate wasted. And that is it right here. Swatched. And this is it on. It's a beautiful chocolate nude for moi. Living my best uh, 90s, you know, rum raisin, chocolate brown life. So let me put this down. Uh, let me come back. I'm, I'm probably going to change my lip one more time. And come back and then just show you the full swatch on my hands. Okay? Okay. Hang on. Okay, back with... Whoop. I just wanted to put on my very bougie Gucci lipstick in 20 Pepo because it goes with my eye look, obviously. I originally started the video with my Pat McGrath lip on, the Matte Trans Shade 200 Mc, McMeany, Mc, McNamey. I should have Googled how to say that, I'm sorry. But let me show you the swatches. Gucci lipstick, so freaking good. I should never have tried this, I should have never known this. So here are the swatches. Ooh. There's some transfer, but don't worry about that. There you 
go. All the shades. How many did I have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, what? 10. So, oof, 16. So, 16. Oh, that's, that's a lot of lipstick. <laughs> <laughs> that's a lot of lipstick and it <laughs> mm. anywho it's so these are my favorite nudes so uh let me get know what you guys think <sighs> oh i want to put on some lip oil my lips hurt lip balm lip oil all of it my lips hurt so bad <laughs> But anywho, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. Please uh, do me a solid. Take care of yourselves. Take care of one another. It would behoove you to make the right smart choices. Yeah. yeah. Uh, please be safe. You know, we're still in an international house of pancakes out there. It ain't over. Not yet. Uh, be safe. Wash your hands. Wash your mask. Wash your arse. Wash your clothes. Uh, if you're thinking of somebody, please let them know that you're thinking of them. All forms of communication. If it's safe, please go see them. Okay, please be safe. Be well. I'm going to try to remember to list all of these lipsticks in the description box. Don't hold me to it. But I'm going to try. I promise. Um, some of these are discontinued. Some of these were limited edition. One that was, I just didn't even mention it because you can't even get it anymore. It was from Urban Decay and it's my favorite. It was the Vice Lip Chemistry in the shade Overload. They don't even make it anymore and I'm so mad. I'm glad I have an extra though. Any hoozies, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Please, I'm going to try this. Like, share, subscribe, comment. I don't know. It feels awkward doing this, but um, I'm just going to give it a go. See how it how it how it feels um see you guys in the next one peace easy have a good one guys uh i'll put some videos up in the corner if you'd like to watch bye